In the final of a three-part look at the Dane County Executive Race, candidates discuss another much-talked-about issue. The Regional Transit Authority, or the RTA, is looking at commuter rail in Dane County. News 3's Brad Jameson has more on how the candidates think transportation should move Dane County forward. The next Dane County Executive will take office as the Regional Transit Authority looks to expand transportation networks. Candidate Zach Brandon says he's cautious of any new tax, particularly a sales tax associated with the RTA. He feels other zoning must be considered. So I support regionalizing planning. I think that you have to look at regional, the regional scope of what we do when it comes to planning. And that means not just planning for where a train or buses might go, but also planning for where roads are going to go and for planning where for new housing is going to go. Eileen Bruskowitz is against a public tax. She's focusing on roads, not the RTA, and is proposing a North Mendota Parkway. She doesn't believe public transportation use will drastically increase. But for these, what they call choice riders, they have a car sitting in the garage, but they'll take the, the bus today. Um, I don't think that that's who we should be targeting our precious dollars to. We need to take care of the people that really need transportation. Scott McDonald believes gas prices will drive people to use public transportation and the system should reach beyond the Madison area. I'm a strong supporter of regional transit. We need a balanced modern transportation system. When gasoline is up at four or five dollars a gallon, people are going to want to be able to you know, shed one car and be able to use transit. And the only way you can do that is have bus system go expand to the county borders. Candidate Joe Parisi favors looking at transportation options across the board. I support the RTA. I voted to create it in the state legislature. We need a balanced approach to transportation, one that looks at roads, paratransit, regional buses, and eventually commuter rail. Joe Winicky is against commuter rail, preferring busing options. He feels transportation planning can improve by looking at new highways, a potential north belt line and south cross over belt line. I believe very strongly that we should have regional planning, regional transit, but I also think that we maybe should slow down the train, if you will, when it comes to an April referendum to make sure that every voter knows what they're voting for. Brad Chameson, WISC News 3. And again, the primary is just days away. It's on Tuesday. After Tuesday, the field will be narrowed down to two candidates who will advance to the general election in April. For more information on each candidate, visit our website, channel3000.com.